hello you guys uh welcome back to my channel my eyes are red are my eyes red my eyes are my eyes red welcome back to my channel uh my name is woven if you are new to the channel you're most welcome and if you are returning familiar pay obrigada obrigado so it is a new week it is a monday i am excited i had quite an early morning uh today so i will be taking you guys on to this week if i get up to anything eventful but if i don't to be a series of weeks but yeah to give you guys a feel of what really happens in my life as a youtuber slash an eight to five so you guys this morning you know it's such a beautiful and blessed morning um it's such a beautiful morning so around eight o'clock while I was getting ready, I receive a call. So I, I obviously quickly take it because it's too early for this person to be calling me. So I'm like, okay, something is probably happening. Let me take the call. And they're like, um, Lato, I just want to speak blessings upon your life. I want to pray for you. And I'm like, oh, wow, God, is this you again? So I'm really experiencing a season of favor right now. And I've just been getting affirmations from God through the word, even in church. Like, and this person says, yeah, let me pray with you. And they, you know, they, they pray and they say the most beautiful blessings over my life. Um, It's just really a beautiful morning. So I started crying, guys. I was so overwhelmed. I started crying. That's why my eyes are red. I have a mirror here. That's why my eyes are red. But yeah, it's, it's, um, the person was just talking blessings, speaking blessings over my life. I was reminded of Isaiah 54 verse 10. You know, I'm going to paraphrase and say something about though the mountains may be shaken and hills removed, my unfailing love will remain and my covenant of peace shall remain. So really, it's just God reaffirming that I love you, my child. I will be here. No matter what's happening in life, no matter what's going on, you know, my peace will be with you like forever. And I was just like, wow, God. Wow, God. So, yeah, I'm blessed this morning. I hope Isaiah 54 verse 10 can bless somebody else. So I am going to, I'm done with my makeup and everything. I'm going to get dressed. But before that, I'm going to make breakfast just so that I don't go to my arm is tired. Yeah, just so that I don't go buy breakfast, which is a bad habit when I have food at home. So yeah, guys, please do enjoy this video. Can you guys hear the birds chirping? So this place, like, I'm literally looking into the mountains. It's so quiet. It's so peaceful. We love it here. So yeah, you guys, please do enjoy the video. I just changed my angle and I don't like this lighting. I like this lighting because there's reflection on one of the car parking lots. Please enjoy the video and please, please continue subscribing. Thank you very much, Familia. Let's go. Okay, so I have decided to make a wrap, breakfast wrap instead, because especially because of these tomatoes that are going bad in the fridge. Um, can you see? So I need to make use of them. And then I got Evo, then I have cheese. Then I'm going to... Mm, this is, why is it open for so long? I think this has been in the fridge for quite some time. So I'll use this one. I have two ribs. So one I have for breakfast. Then I'll have one for lunch. Then I have some bacon that I'm just going to use. And then some eggs. So guys, how do you get your eggs fluffy? This is what I do. Sometimes I use fresh milk. But today I'll be using this almond milk because I just want to finish it so it doesn't go to waste. And then I blend. And you guys will see that process or you have seen this process in my other videos before but to have that nice fluffy scrambled egg you should add a bit of milk to your egg while whisking before you add it to your pan
yeah so i've made my breakfast now i'm just chewing the leftovers and i'm going to pack my lunch box and i'm going to head to work um do i also need to show you guys what i'm packing in my lunch box let me let me do that yeah so let me show you guys how i pack my lunch box it's quite a big one because i don't eat everything at the same time some of the things i keep in my fridge at work okay so we have my wrap here um I think I'll just take a banana. I'm also going to um take this juice to work. I just like to keep why is it doing this at the back? When is the expiry date? Okay, but they always do this. All these juices, the freshly squeezed juices always or cold pressed. The cold pressed juices always do this. So you have to shake properly. So I won't have all of it, but I'm taking it to work. And I'm putting in a yogurt. This is a double cream something. Mm -hmm. Then I got this chocolate from my friend. I'm also taking it to work. I don't really eat chocolate, but yeah, I keep it there just as a snack as and when. That is essentially me. I'm going to get dressed now. Okay, so yeah, I am ready. I am going to head to work right now. But um, a bit later, I am going to... So you guys, since winter is fast approaching, I usually take my... I'm not wearing a seatbelt. I usually take my winter stuff to the dry cleaners just before winter so that by the time winter comes, I sort of don't have to get out of the house. So I drop my coat on Thursday at the dry cleaner. So I'll pick that up later, maybe during my lunch hour. So yeah. All of the snow in this winter land used to look so pretty. Now making me moody. Who's this? Guardambo. Oh. <laughs> so hi guys. I got here way before check-in time. So I done left my bags like at the storage or whatever the hotel. And then I went about my day because we're not done with my room. And I see the sun setting. <laughs> so I'll give you guys a quick room tour. And then I'm going to go out and have a few drinks and then i will be back and i will see you guys tomorrow as usual door closing that sounded like my name anyways you have a toilet in there then you have a shower in there you have a bathtub here so i'll be looking like I don't have so much energy, so yeah, that's my bathroom. Yeah, weirdly, you get into the bathroom first, and then we have whatever this is. This is if you have children, and then we've got a mirror here, and then oh, I'm bare feet. We have our bed there. I think these beds are quite small. Is this a double bed? I think they're small. And then they've got a wall art there. I think it just brings like a, a nice pop of color to the room and a bit of art. This is how it looks like from the side. And then sun is setting. I've got a bit of a view. I hope I can take maybe a video tomorrow where it's a bit clear. But this is how it looks like when the sun sets. Well, well, well. I'll give you guys a better view when I wake up actually. In the morning if i wake up yeah and then here we've got oh wardrobe space that lights don't ask me about the two glasses this is my glass and yeah <sighs> that's the good morning <laughs> Good morning, you guys. My voice. Please excuse me. Morning, you guys. It's another day in my life. <laughs> my
my voice is so embarrassing but we went out last night street clubs street clubs we went out last night and we got back around some time we got back <laughs> to the hotel but we are having breakfast now but i don't know why i actually have all the energy i got up i got ready please excuse me i drink sparkling water it just gives you a kick of sparkling water but yeah i i i got up and i got ready and i don't know why i did that because i am going back to bed right after this the idea was to go to the mall because yesterday we didn't get time Hi. but me i'm not going to the mall maybe later on maybe a bit later to we'll go to the mall but for now i'm just going to to have breakfast i'll show you guys and then i'll i'll catch up on some much needed sleep i don't think i'm 21 i know i'm not 21 but i think yesterday we just thought we are 21 now we are quarter to 50 so yeah but also guys it's becoming increasingly difficult for me to vlog when there are people around especially in the hotel so i actually didn't give you the hotel tour i give you a room tour so let me give you we're staying at the Maslow. i give you a room tour Ninia, yesterday or the day before yesterday so let me let me give you a bit of a tour if there are no people it's very nice and green that's the big this is like a I guess place to chill but the only thing I see chilling here is the birds that's the hotel and then there are people sitting there I will try to give you bits and pieces as well as I go along shedding has no protocol we're busy trying to buy what we need to buy and the electricity goes off guys now today i am doing uh quite luxury shopping i'm sitting inside the shop now. Hi guys, the last time you saw me, I think I still had a bit of life. If people tell you to go out, me after you turn in your thirties, don't do it. Try to go out while you are still in your twenties, because at quarter to forty, you don't recover. So I'm at the airport. Um, Waiting for my flight, but I want to go for a spa station. I need to break out here. I don't even know what that is. So yeah. 